Hey folks, this is pre-walk. It is 9 a.m. exactly. I was awake at 7 a.m. Allowed myself to just rest in bed because I didn't want to get up and walk that early. Um, found a nice treat in the kitchen. Abby made no-bake cookies sometime last night, probably when it cooled off, which I don't know when it cooled off last night, which is why I didn't end my video yesterday. So I'm so sorry. I... Um, I don't even remember my night. Oh, I got home from running to Ulta. We went to try and take my friend home from her work, but she had a late client and couldn't leave when I picked her up. Told her I'd wait for her or I'd come back for her. She refused. And then one of her coworkers saw what I was doing. They know that I do this. Um, and they said they would take her home. And I, I, <laughs> everyone, even the clients in the room, they were like, they understood that I was going to take her home. And I was like, and, and I saw one customer and I was like, it's 95 degrees outside. She walks home. And the client was like, oh, and I was like, exactly. Which is why I will sit outside and wait until she's done and I'll take her home. And her coworker kept saying, I'll take her home. I, and I was like, I kind of said to the whole room, including her manager, if she walks home, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> so I'm hoping she did not walk home. I'm really praying that they did not let her walk home. It was still 95 degrees at eight o'clock that night. Last night, it was still 95. Our room, because I didn't take my AC into my room until 9.30 last night, because I wanted the girls to have as much cold air as possible, the battery's flashing. Our room was a sauna. It was so hot all night. It did. I did not cool off until probably one in the morning. And I know Jason didn't either. He was really bothered by it. So, a little tired today, but um, we're getting the house cooled off today. So, I have an hour and a half to walk. I wanted two hours, but an hour and a half is good. Um, should be able to get four or five miles in if I hurry. Um, and then I'm supposed to meet people for lunch. It's like a mini church activity just to get women out and about and just doing things without too much structure or planning involved. Bring your own lunch, come to the park. I picked one with a covered pavilion, um, also with a playground and open grass area. If people need to bring their kids, they're more than welcome to. I have no idea if anyone's going to show up. No one has said they're going to show up. <laughs> so I'm going to go get a Cafe Rio salad as soon as I am done walking because it'll be around 11 o'clock, 11.30 or so by the time I actually get there to the park, get set up. Um, so I will want to eat, eat. Um, who is texting me? It's in my pocket. I'll, I'll look at it in a second. So that's my plan. If um, my kids are not awake or if Ashley does not have actual plans quite yet or if her friends are being dropped off, I told parents yesterday she is free to play today. They can come over. Um, if they are already being dropped off or there's already a plan in place, I'm going to get my nails done. If I'm lucky and they're still occupied, after I get my nails done at the salon I like to go to, I'll go to the other salon where my friend works that I tried to take home last night. That sounds bad tried to give her a ride home last night, I will go to her place because I have a disc, uh, gift card. I got it I got it a long time ago. If you guys remember, you remember. I got a gift card from her um, a long time ago and I will go and cash that in for my toes because I realized last night I got these nails over three weeks ago. It's been three and a half weeks. I have never let them go that long. They're bad. So... I might even get a different color. We might go for a summer color. We'll see. Okay, let's go for a walk. All right, I am done with my walk. And I am here at Cafe Rio. Got my butt sweat towel. That comes in handy. I have a $10 credit. Cafe Rio opened a mere 15 minutes ago. <laughs> so I'm gonna go get myself a salad. I got four miles in, so I did pretty good today. Nothing to hold me back.
All right, well, kind of a flop on uh, my luncheon at the park. We didn't really advertise it very well. Um, part of that was because I wasn't really in charge of doing so. I made one Facebook post about it, but um, they just uh, didn't advertise for it very well. So only the other main coordinator and a friend showed up. And somehow I walked out of Cafe Rio with no fork. <laughs> so it's now been an hour and 20 minutes since I got there and I still haven't even eaten my food. <laughs> I'm very hungry. Um, but I had a good time talking to the two who came, so it wasn't a waste of time. And I normally don't get a lot of time to talk with them anyway. And so it was good. We got to sit in the shade and have a good time. So I just checked in with Ashley back at home. I have been coordinating getting friends over for her to play with. They're all back in town. Um, they're all arriving there or already there. And so she is occupied. So I just made an appointment to get my nails done. Very needed, but they can't see me for about an hour. So I am gonna go and change. I still, it's still really, it's 96 degrees. So sorry, I'm keeping the tank top on. <laughs> I might um, change out of my little, uh, what do you call them? I'm not gonna show you because well, they're little biker shorts. <laughs> I need to change out of those, put it on something a little bit more comfortable. So we'll go home, check in with Ashley. I mean, the rest of the girls are there too, but um, they're pretty self-sufficient. And then I'll go get my nails done. And we're just trying to deal with the heat. It's supposed to cool off tomorrow by 10 degrees, which will feel a ton different. Um, it'll feel like a normal summer, <laughs> so. Okay, nails are done. Do you like it? Do you like it? I've never really, I mean, I've done this color before, but a long time ago. I don't know that you guys have ever seen me do this color. I just wanted something different. I might do the same color on my toes. I don't know, but I think it's kind of fun. They actually were gonna do a more muted tone but then they, they put both of them on and I really liked this one. Oh, it is so hot in here. It is so hot. Um, what I wanna do is go home to AC and just relax and edit, but Abby informed me as soon as I walked out, are you gonna go anywhere? Like a store? <laughs> I said, yes, Abby, I'll go to Costco. She's like, can I come with you? <laughs> just because Jason worked yesterday and probably will not actually get a day off this week. He probably will run his health fair on Friday as well. Maybe he's not, I don't know. But we are officially out of milk. So that is my sign to go stock up. I mean, there are a few other things that we need. So I'm gonna go home and get oh, Abby. Sorry about that. I'm gonna go home and get Abby. And then um, we'll go see what kind of a, it's always a little dangerous to go to Costco with Abby. <laughs> not, not gonna lie, but um, it is kind of fun too. All right, it is hot out here. So I'm gonna do this Costco haul fast. Cucumbers, corn, and I'm gonna try Alani. Switching this out for the Celsius. I've seen some really good concoctions with the Alani. Um, I don't drink energy drinks like this, but Maybe I'd do that instead of a Coke. Um, bagels, strawberries, grapes. Um, I can get a better price at the grocery store, so I just got one of those. Blueberries, I got some cute swim trunks. I'm gonna go to the beach tomorrow, so I can just wear those with a little swim tank top or my swimsuit top. These were only six bucks for three tank tops, so that was a good deal. I just need um, new workout shirts. Um, deodorant, um, liquid IV, we're gonna try that with our waters for an electrolyte, um, cheese, sour cream, the honey, the, what do you call it, graham crackers on rebate. Um, I've got the Just Bear chicken tenders, french fries, milk, um, cream cheese, cottage cheese, cheese, I think that's it. But I'm gonna get the door shut so we can start cooling it down and get home. I know man, passing by, 
Life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so ending, so where I can find myself. All right, we're at home, unpacked. This one hasn't done her dishes. Got our fruit soaking in vinegar water. Chelsea did the grapes. Yeah, you gonna freeze some of those? Not all of them, but just some of them. Um, I just realized I'm wearing the same shirt I wore yesterday. <laughs> I'm editing that video. I'm like, wait, what video am I editing? I only wore this one for a little bit yesterday, and then I. You also wore it for Fourth of July. I did, but I washed it since then. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's okay to have it. Been a couple hours. We're really just trying to stay cool. Her friends have gone home. Yeah, to stay cool. Um, but I forgot to mention to you guys, and I was going to tell Jason here at the same time. What? I went on my walk this morning when it wasn't so hot. I mean, in the sunshine, it was hot. Oh, your battery's starting to go. Ah, dang batteries. She's hot. All right. Um, anyway, so I went for my walk, and I was only like maybe a half mile, quarter mile, three quarter mile in. Um, and I had quite a bit of time to walk today. I got up there with plenty of time, and... I came around the corner and this lady was coming toward me. Two ladies were coming toward me. And um and can I stepped off to the right and um Sorry. said hi to her and whatnot. I I don't recognize her or anything, but she stopped me and she's like, Oh my gosh, you are doing so good. And I was like, I'm only on my first lap. And she's like, You were here yesterday, you're here all the time. Oh, and I was like, a regular. yeah, I know. And I was like, I am here all the time. Yes. And she's like, you're hardcore. She's like, you just go around and around and around and around. And <laughs> we talked about, you know, like, do you go off a path? Do you go up into the, onto the trails? And I said, yes. When my daughter comes with me, she likes to go on the trails. Um, but right now it's too hot to go up into those because they're not shaded. And I've been looping around. The, the baseball diamond if I don't get if I get off track and I walk to my car and I walk to the bathroom Then that's like a quarter mile. And so I'm like, oh, I don't want to do a of full the bathroom is in route. It is in my route. We talked about that. She's like you have to go to a go She's like you have to find a place with the bathroom. We're that old <laughs> like that's the point in our life She's maybe like five ten years older than me, but she just laughed and she was like Anyway, I was talking to her. I was like, yeah, my friends like, you know, walk around Issaquah and, you know, the trails and stuff there. But I'm like, I gotta have a bathroom. And she was like, girl, I got you. I got you. That's why I come here too. It was just very fun. But then we talked about like um, the health benefits for actually walking versus like trying to run and go faster and get it done faster and whatnot. And she said, I've actually been doing a lot of research lately about the major health benefits for walking because when you get your, she said that, and I've talked to my dad about this as well. She said when you run or you walk extremely fast or work out, your heart rate goes up. Um, but that also for women in their 40s, 50s, that releases cortisol, is that right? And that doesn't necessarily do you a lot of good when you're trying to like lose weight. And so, she said lots of walking like you're doing is actually really, really beneficial. So if that gives you guys any extra motivation, um, it does not matter how fast you go. It doesn't matter how many miles you do. Just start walking because it's actually really, really good for you. Jason's dad, his grandpa, um, he lived until 94 and the only reason why he passed away was because well, he was 94 because he walked every day or he rode his bike every day or he walked on his treadmill during the winter. And the guy was a beast. I mean, he's Jason Stock. <laughs> you know, he's he's a, a motivated guy to like stay in shape. Um, the only reason why he passed away is because he fell off of his bike at the age of 94, broke his hip, got a hip replacement and got pneumonia in the hospital. It's the only reason why he passed away. So, um, anyway, that which I just wanted to say that. Jason's already gone upstairs. He just got home um, from his health fair and from work. He kind of had to keep going back and forth, I believe. He had to go and cut paychecks and after he set up at the health fair. And um, you guys, this is why I don't buy cereal. And this is a total side note. 
I bought four or five boxes of no, cereal. Okay, it's this is the third one out of five. I've had two bowls of cereal. Two bowls. Three boxes in two days. Given we're trying not to cook, so I'm giving it to them this week. I'm like, don't turn that oven on, even though I really, really want to make corn on the cob. I bought corn on the cob, as you saw. So I'm waiting for it to cool down before I can start boiling. Um, but I also need to go back to Costco tonight. I think I'm gonna do it tonight and try and take my friend home. Jason has, oh, it's blurry. Come back. There we go. He brought home teriyaki. Except there's no more sauce left in it. It's just gonna make it dry. Um, I got home from Costco with Abby and we were talking about our day tomorrow. We're gonna go out to the lake so she's gonna go to our regular lake and we realized I haven't gotten to full mode for um, the summer. I have one can of sunscreen, but we're going to two different lakes. <laughs> so I need to go back and get another one. I just don't wanna have to mess with that. Oh, blurry, come on, focus. There you go. I'm gonna take these upstairs. I don't have any laundry to take up except for this. What was I saying? Oh, I'm gonna go walking in the morning and then I'm gonna pick up her friends I from their houses. You so that I... You're gonna go and walk four miles with me in the morning? Four miles? <laughs> she won't go walk with me. I'll just go pick up your friends. We'll come back here, finish packing I'll up lunch. Up Tomorrow morning you need to make, why don't you make like three or four, two or three peanut butter sandwiches for yourself and maybe for me. Oh. But I'm, so I need to go to Costco tonight right before they close here. I'm trying to get it to cool down to get more sunscreen and I think I'm gonna get croissants. I've been doing this with Chelsea today. I don't like it. It's really easy to, to goat her. Dad, she's being mean. She's being mean, not to Chelsea. Yeah. Don't be mean. So you go like Oh that. my gosh. <laughs> so <laughs> dumb. Hi. Hey. Gosh. Anyway, that's my plan. That's that's our ditty. So, um, we're just. I'm I'm taking the AC earlier tonight. I just yeah, our room was too place. hot. Was it was too hot last night. It was brutal. I was like just laying there sweating. I had to take off my like pillow on my body pillow to like. Cause yeah. And so I had to yeah, I had to like move all the I, sheets off the bed. Yeah, I, had I couldn't to have anything touched. Like sheet for my yeah, even the way I was laying on my pillow, I was like, this feels too hot. But I can't fall asleep like laying on my back. So, <sighs> you do what you gotta do. Okay. Okay. We achieved nothing. <laughs> no, we did. What? You I didn't, didn't get my copies. You didn't get your copies. <laughs> you didn't return the thing you went for. <laughs> we stood in line too long trying to return the shorts. Those little beach shorts didn't fit me right. And I don't want to hang on to them long enough for them to fit. That's just kind of depressing. And so I was in line to return them too long. The line was too long. And so then I left him in line and I ran and got the sunscreen and I got croissants and some chicken to make croissant sandwiches for the summer. And um, by the time I came back, the line had not grew. Moved. It had not moved at all. The same two customers were being helped. And uh, we gave up on that and we ran over to give my friend a ride home from the place that she works and they were closed already and she'd already left so we tried to figure out what way she might be walking home and we couldn't find her and so now I'm sad I couldn't get my copies because they were closed like early yeah I don't, I don't know. so not a complete loss but it wasn't we got completely... spent time together Tender. Tender. <laughs> I get a TV where it's cool <laughs> but I think I'm gonna sign off with you guys I need to get beet stuff kind of squared away. I might even make uh, my chicken salad tonight. Um, just to, well, maybe not cutting up the grapes tonight, but making the chicken salad um, portion itself. So I don't have to come home after my walk tomorrow to do that. And then we'll pack up the rest of our lunch and go to the beach. So that should be fun tomorrow. But um, we have to kind of go in and, fight for the AC 
so we can relax and call it a night when it's not even like 7 30. <laughs> i get this if you get that i like hey i got it put you down we're gonna see you guys later take care